Good morning. I've got a friend out here who's been whacking on a tree a bunch. Most mornings around 7.30ish recently. It's one of these. The largest woodpecker in all of North America. The pileated woodpecker, or pileated if you prefer. This time of year, late January, we start to hear them drumming. Which is pretty much the equivalent of a song for woodpeckers. They don't have the vocal musculature <clears throat> in their syrinx to sing like we think about as bird song. However, they advertise who they are, where they are, by finding the perfect substrate right there to bang on and let others know they're around. So that is just what they do. <laughs> They've been doing it for a long time. Pileateds are basically um, ecosystem engineers. We talk about beavers in that sense because of all the habitat they create, but pileated woodpeckers do the same thing. When they use that massive chisel-like bill of theirs to smash into trees to get their favorite food, carpenter ants where I live, um, they create cavities, big holes that end up being homes for so many other species. Other woodpeckers, other birds, um, mice, squirrels, flying squirrels in particular around here especially. Um, and those places are critical, critical, warm, safe places for all those other species to live. So I like to think of them as kind of real estate developers in the forest. Now this pileated drum starts off kind of fast, but right towards the end, it slows down. And that's how we distinguish them from, say, the hairy woodpecker, the downy woodpecker, all the other woodpeckers here on this continent. So, listen up for the drumming of woodpeckers, especially as winter slowly turns into spring soon. So, quick last look. Massive stunning bird, pileated woodpecker. Thanks for being here, and good bird.